I thought I would revisit uh, PlayStation Plus. You guys know I got my new PS3 controller, if you saw a couple videos back. Um, yeah, I'm on a PS3. I have my PS4, have my PS2, and I still have my PS Vita. So, I have a lot of systems to support. Uh, out of the four, three of them are supported by PlayStation Plus, giving me free games each month. So, what we're going to do is we're going to count this up. Uh, to see how much you're saving because I know haters are still attacking the fact that you pay $50 for PlayStation Plus but how much you save you know whether you have the system or not it's how much you are saving that's all that really matters so let's go back into it um, we got two games Bioshock Infinite and DMC that are $39.99 so we're gonna do $39.99 times two that's seventy nine dollars and ninety eight cents worth of saving that's over fifty dollars that's over fifty dollars that you're saving on just these two games that they give you look we're about to do overkill right now so if you're a wii u fan shut the fuck up if you're an xbox 360 fan or xbox one fan shut the fuck up just watch the whole video this is why your service is inferior to PlayStation Plus. Xbox One um, uh, 360's version of Xbox Live does not give you free new games. They do not do that. And no, don't say these. Let's go back over to These three games came out two years ago. Because it didn't. And that would be a blatant lie. Because I know that's, that's the little... The little uh, lie that you guys tell people in your little uh, arguments is that, oh, you guys are getting games that are three years old. And nah, dude, don't do that shit. Let's add up uh, Borderlands 2. That is uh, $29.99. It brings the total of savings all the way up to $109.97. We're going to add Dyad. Um, that'll be $14.99. That brings the savings up to $124.96. Then we're going to add uh, Binary Domain, which I do want to play. And I already downloaded all of these titles. Um, let's see. That's $19.99. Equals. Whoa, that's a lot of fucking money. Okay. $144.96. 95 cents is your savings so far oh man oh look at all the, look at the rest of this this video isn't gonna take that much of your time but it's very funny because of uh any wii u person comes out and say this is the reason why you need a wii u you bring up playstation plus any xbox fanboy tries to tell your friend or family members this is the reason why you need an xbox one or a 360 what you do then you bring up playstation plus that's what you do that's how you defeat them. This is how you own them. With the truth. Okay, so we're going to... Ib, ib ob. We're going to add that. Uh, let's see. Plus... Nine, nine, $154.95. So you, it's tri tri at this point in time, it's triple the savings. I just got a uh, text message. Don't mind that. I answered. Oh, fuck. Wait up, wait up, wait up, wait up, wait up. 154, 94. 154, 94 plus 1999. $174.93 is your savings so far. And I just added ICO. So far, with all these games. This is your savings. This is your savings. And to be completely honest, sometimes PlayStation uh, stores uh, price for your games are much cheaper than that if you go into a retail store because you know they're going to charge you tax. On PlayStation, um, on the PlayStation store, as far as I know, when I buy my games, I don't pay extra. I just pay the flat rate that is uh, $9.99, something like that. I don't pay extra for tax. Um, so we got to add this last one up. $9.99. 
So your savings right now comes up to $184.92. Almost $200 worth of savings off of a service you guys bitch about saying, um, what is it you guys say? Oh, it's still $50. It's almost the same as Xbox Live. Xbox Live is $60, and they don't give you nearly as many uh, choices as these. They just do not do that. Um, the rest of these games I've already purchased, and since they're not featured, they're not telling me the price of what they used to be since I've already purchased and downloaded them. Well, you know, when you download them, they mark it as purchased. So, uh, we could just, let's just add up Uncharted. Let's just add up Uncharted and say, uh, let's see, plus, let's just be generous and give it, uh, $30. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Let's give it twenty nine ninety nine. That will be that. That will put the savings over two hundred and fourteen dollars and ninety one cents. And uh, Little Big Planet Carton should be around nineteen ninety nine equals two hundred and thirty four dollars and and ninety cents. It's, it's, the savings is crazy. And then, like I said, not to mention the PS Vita titles that you're saving on. You're saving on PS Vita titles as well as the PS4 titles, which they don't show when you're on a PS3. But there's some free, uh, to play, there's some free PlayStation plus PS4 titles, uh, that I didn't cover in this video. But you guys get my point. You get a full game collection. Look at the PS Vita right here. You get Wipeout. 2048, Uncharted, Golden Abyss, Gravity Rush, Outworld, Stranger's Wrath, HD Edition, uh, Sonic and All-Stars Racing's Transform, Urban Trial, Freestyle for the PS Vita. You get those six games that keep you occupied for more than three months, maybe even more. It all depends on how you play. Um, it keep you occupied for a pretty long time, all of these games. And just the other month, uh... Just the other month, it was, uh, what was it? It was like, uh, Soul Sacrifice. Soul Sacrifice was free. And some other stuff. Let's go see. And then look at all these discounts. Like, you get, you get shit loads of discounts. What's this? See, I might have to buy some of these fucking games, man. Okay, we can put the, the damn foam down. We don't gotta add up any more stuff. I mean... But damn. Oh wow, look at this. Enslaved. That was a shit game. But for $5, I would buy it. Wow, look at this. Rain. You know how I love water. That game is only $3.75 if you have PlayStation Plus. Well worth it. Well, oh my fucking. Crisis 3. N did not buy this game. I did not want to spend $60 on it, but now with PlayStation Plus, it's only $5. If they got all this stuff running tomorrow when I get my paycheck, guaranteed I will get it. Guaranteed, I will definitely get it. Uh, Epic Mickey 2, The Power of 2 for the PS Vita, only $7.50. If you haven't played uh, Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker for the PS uh, Vita or PS4, uh, PS Vita, PSP, PS3, on the PS Vita PSP systems, it's only six dollars and ninety nine cents. Can't beat that. Cannot beat that. Especially with the new Metal Gear games coming out for the PS4 and PS3. Can't beat it. Um. Oh, these are avatars. Street Kicks, freestyle game. Oh, I never, I never heard of Street Kicks before. Looks kind of fun. Then you got these avatar bundles, uh, pretty cheap, because most avatars are uh, 50 cents, 49 cents each, so, damn, I mean, just unlimited savings, whether they're, they're, they're giving you the discounts, or they're giving you free games, PlayStation Plus is much better than what any other gaming company is doing for the gamers. Okay, they're doing this for the gamers. Just look at that. You see it right there? Just look at that. I mean, what the fuck? 12 months for 49.99.
and uh sorry I just hit my <laughs> hit my headset real quick and from what we from what uh we just went over we would be saving the games that I talked about we will be saving two hundred and thirty four dollars and ninety cents and you're only paying forty nine ninety nine for PlayStation Plus and that's how much you're saving that's how much you're saving on your games I mean that's a lot nobody should bitch about this when Xbox Live is charging you fifty dollars, uh, sixty dollars. I mean, they're charging you sixty dollars for twelve months, and they're not giving you free games on the Xbox One, or the Xbox, or the uh, wait a wait a wait up. They don't have a handheld. Sorry, they're not giving you uh many free games on the Xbox 360 or Xbox One. They don't even have a handheld. Sony's giving you free games across three different platforms. Microsoft cannot even say that. And my, uh, Nintendo, they don't have any service that gives you free games. You know, they they don't. They're giving you savings like this. It's just not happening, man. Sony wants you to play their games. They want you to play games. The other competitors, they just really don't. They don't give a fuck. If you're broke, they don't care. You know, they don't. This is just, this is crazy. Some some games you save more on than others. Of course, I'm looking on this list, but when you get into the games, that they, they're like, eh, we really want you to get this game. Just, we're going to give it to you for 14, to 4, 419 right there. I mean, this one, 375 rain. I got to get this game tomorrow. I got to get this game. 375, I mean, they doing a, they really trying to clear this out. Puppeteer. Puppeteer really did not like the demo, but at seven dollars, somebody really might get it. Crisis three at five dollars, that's a fucking steal. I don't care how you look at it, that's a fucking steal. Crisis three for five dollars. GameStop will never sell you these games for these prices. Never, never. The lowest I see GameStop games for is nineteen ninety nine. You can be honest with yourself, unless they in their bargain bin for nine ninety nine. Which is the total lowest that they're going to give you. Look at this. Tales of Exilia. Tales of Exilia. A great RPG for the PS3. Only $10 with PlayStation Plus. Look at this. Kills all mercenaries. $9 now for the PS Vita. If you haven't got Kills on Mercenaries and you're a Kills on fan. Definitely get this game. Sorry that this video is taking forever. But, you know, it's it's true. I'm trying to help you guys out. I know I haven't did it one of these videos, but just look at these prices. You know, this is the reason why people got PlayStation Plus. They're really saving you money. I wonder what this, uh... Oh, so this is like a freestyle soccer game that they made. Hmm. They still got Arkham Blackgate at full price. Would not get it. Not gonna get it. Dragon's Crown is a great game. I already got that. And of course, Persona. I love that fucking game. When this goes down a little bit, like $10 or $15, definitely could get it for the Vita. Oh, definitely want a Ratchet and Clank game for the Vita. Okay, guys. That is it. That concludes this uh, video. Just remember you're saving over $200, you know, from what I wanted to add up. I can't even start to fathom some of the prices of the games, uh, what they are now, because they, they're not telling me because I already downloaded them. But uh, from right here, these feature games, you're saving over $100, just right here with these three titles. That's crazy. Just with these three titles right here, you're saving over $100, and you pay $50 for PlayStation Plus. Okay, well, hopefully you guys learned something. Uh, I think the only links I'm going to have in the description is going to my PSN account, so you guys can see my current trophies, as well as my Twitch TV. I told you guys that if I get 50 uh, followers on Twitch, I'm going to start doing my live streams for my PS4. Still have yet to get the 50 followers. Um, still go wait on that.
but I definitely will do some of these gameplay commentaries upon request. So uh, we're going to talk about that in a little bit. I'll see you guys later.